It all started as we headed eagerly into Dogwood Pass. Can you believe it, hon? We're here. Well, I was gonna wear my cowboy hat and everything. And, well, I didn't. But I do have my cowboy boots. Welcome to Dogwood Pass. Just in time for Christmas. Dogwood Pass is a replica of an old west mining town Mike Montgomery and his wife Charlene built in Beaver, Ohio with over 30 buildings that include the Dogwood Pass Roy Rogers Museum and it's said the Grinch hangs out here and rumor has it we might even see Santa and maybe a shootout or two. We had to find out. Looking all westerny. Put your boots on. Yeah, you ready to cowgirl? No hat. This here's the church. Got to go in. Got to get a special blessing before we go through. This is a gunfighting town after all. Seriously. Uh oh, looks like the parson ain't in town yet. This is cute. This is all DIY for the most part. Some of it, according to the owner, is original, but some of it's been rebuilt and they're trying to get it to where it's original Sunday. So inside the church, we found this beautiful old wedding gown. Most of the stuff they say that are in these places that we're taking you to are actually original. There are some that they uh, have made to look, but every place is open. So all the different items you'll be in here, majority of them will actually be original for the particular time frame. I'm guessing this is where the hymnals would have been? or maybe it's a school when it's not a church. Kind of makes sense with the chalk boards. We've been hitting a lot of things like this lately where all the Christmas lights are up and running. And look at this cool bridge. Look at snowmen. Snowmen everywhere. Surrounded. Very cool. Literally. Is this a chuck wagon or just a regular schooner? This looks so authentic. It's gotta be real. The wheels are wood. I like this. It's got a it's got a deck. <laughs> Schooner with a deck. <laughs> this must be where you pick and sing. I knew he wanted to sit in Santa Claus seat. <laughs> oh. Feels good. Feels kind of natural, you know? Santa. We assume this is Santa's chair anyway. I'm you, assuming. You better get up before some kid <laughs> comes up and yeah, sits on your Someone's gonna want to sit in my lap. <laughs> Good. Okay. We're gonna go across the bridge into the old west town now. Look at this. Isn't this nice? Kind of primitive buildings, but with all these LEDs, they look a lot better. Really Christmassy. This looks like where you get your old time photos taken. Maybe we need an old time photo for a modern day. Does that work? I wonder. Yes, you can get your old west photo. Watch ya. Look at this. Built in type, I'm sure. This place is fun. I was wondering, honey, I think we should pay a visit to the gun shop. I mean, it is a pistol packing town here. I tell you what, it is a beautiful town. We've only scratched the surface. I think we're waiting for the Grinch show. Hang on, we'll get some of that on video too. Santa's daughter, maybe? I don't know. <laughs> don't, don't think it's Mrs. Claus. No, I don't think no. so. Small bubble, too. Oh, yeah. Hey, Santa. Yes, Santa. Hello. Hi, Santa. Hi, Santa. Honestly, seeing so few cars on the road to Dogwood Pass, that's kind of out of the middle of nowhere. We were worried it wouldn't be all we thought it would be. We ended up being pleasantly surprised. I found out yeah. Santa has a house here. He does, of course, he does. Right behind us. You want to go to the Santa house? I want to go to the Santa house. Oh, you want to go to the Santa house? Did you see the name of it? Santa house. It says, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> on the top, it's Santa's house. It but is. it's a Santa house. We're going to go check it out to. Uh, it's a cowboy Santa. Cowboy Santa. Dick, it. Uh oh, there's a show happening. Got to check out the show. I think it's a great show. I'm not sure, but everybody's running, so we're going to follow. Dang, you completely lost, Pete! It's a cowboy I'll show. Tell you what, it's Christmas, you know! Kev, where are you at? I think they don't like me no very much, and it'd be a good time to get them a present, and, but I don't have any money, and if I don't get them a present, they ain't gonna give me a present. Drama in Dogwood Pass. 
See, there it is. I told you, the Santa house. Ho, ho, ho. Gotta go inside and see what's going on. Oh, there's so much stuff that keeps getting our attention, like this Roy Rogers Museum. Look at this. Roy Rogers stuff. Wow. He was big in the 40s, 50s, and 60s. Doing them cowboy westerns. Starting out as a singing cowboy. Wound up with Dale Evans, his wife. Many, many years. Of course, we're both gone now. The Roy Rogers Museum in Oklahoma, I think it was. That's where it used to be, I guess. This is all the relics from there after it closed. Actual boots, actual hat. Roy Rogers. Look at these movie posters. Wow. The Golden Stallion. South of Caliente. Caliente means, from what I understand, hot in the Spanish language. Here this Dale's outfits and her hat. If you're a Western fan and you know Roy Rogers, this is a great place to be. Happy Trails in reference to the song that Dale wrote that they used as their closing theme for their TV show. That's gotta be a trigger, I'm sure. Look at this. This is great. Oh, look at that stagecoach. Oh, you did? Of course, they had the toys. I don't know if they called them action figures back then, but that's pretty much what they were. You can have your own Western town. And the piece de resistance. Roy on trigger. Look who's got his own outhouse. <laughs> Santa. Oh yeah, it's 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 occupied. Yeah. Look at this, we caught Calamity Jane. Yeah. And you don't look like a life. calamity at all, Jane. Well, yeah. Martha Jane Kennedy, you know, I'm an important person, you know. You I'm are. Trailblazer in my time, and and you know I actually helped General George Armstrong Custer. Mm. And then we ventured through Dogwood Pass, and I just I just hung out here, you know. Vanessa's putting off going into Santa's house, and I can't figure out why. Uh oh, gunshots! <laughs> the show is starting to get a little wild over there. Yeah, I really want to go into Santa's house now. Some other stores we're going to check out too. The Creative Wires. Let's go in and find out what Creative Wires is about, shall we? It's really cute in here. Not quite sure what they're doing. Oh, look at the roof. And they actually won two awards this year. Got a little Christmas storage. Picture of the fairy house. This is pilot. Wood prices went crazy last year, so I told him when the prices got just low enough. I said, "Go get me eight sheets of plywood." I want you to mark it out to make it. Oh so gosh. this mm -hmm. is plywood. Mm -hmm. It's not a plank. Mm -mm. You actually did this by hand with a sharpie. Mm -hmm. <laughs> wow. Okay? Okay? And then oh, some burnishing. Okay. Then some burnishing. Look at this. This is fantastic. And evidently it's creative wires because her last name is Wires, the lady who owns a place with her husband. And these are the creative wire weavings. That she yeah. does. But my last name is not spelt like wire, it's pronounced like wire. Oh, okay. So it was like a spin off of our name. Yeah. Look at this, Pop Stone. That's what I wanted for the mention. Oh, that is but how awesome. How long did you take you to get it? Oh, we did That's got to be real. Oh, my God. Of course, with what they've done with creativity, I don't know. <laughs> Might not be. A time, and I do use the, the cash drawer. It's missing parts, and I'm just not going to deal with it. So the cash register is real. Oh, yeah. 1905? Mm hmm. Wow. What about the Papelli stove thing? That's real too. It's that real. That was actually in somebody's garage, rusting away. Wow. Talk about a wealth of information. Man, this was worth the trip. There was a lot of original stuff in that in that particular one. There I know was. she had put a lot of things to make it look old, but a lot of the stuff, like they say in these places, are really original. Wow. Look at Frosty. He's actually dancing and talking. Just don't ask him to sing. All right, 
first impression go? Amazing. This place, we've been here an hour and a half. We've only been in probably a fifth of the buildings. They are so original. Most of it is original. But the well, incredible, uh-oh, we're, we're in the, in the way, way of the, the horse, horse again. <sighs> well, it's a horse town. You gotta come. If you're close anywhere to Columbus, Ohio, look for Dogwood Pass. Okay, going into the bar, maybe getting a sarsaparilla. Who knows? Definitely has an atmosphere. Wow. Oh, it's the Grinch. See how this is going to go. <laughs> yeah, really? Grinch making the rounds. Looks kind of happy from what I can tell. Huh. Right in front of us, exclusive interview with Bad Frank. Frank, why do they call you Bad? Because I'm bad. Bad? I like to interrogate people a little harshly. Ah, okay. I'm, I'm a deputy. Oh, that's good. I can be bad, but that's good. Just curious. Oh, I can be plenty bad. It's plenty good, too. I think Grinch is getting a bad rap. I really do. See, see, smiling. I mean, come on. I can see the Grinch is a lot humbler. Oh, different story. So it's not true. They said the Grinch smelled. Uh, oh, okay. <laughs> no. By the way, they are hiring some new girls, can can dancers, piano player, and showgirls, singers. So, uh, you need a job. More places to check out. It just never ends. Plenty of places to check out. Oh, you gotta get in here. Oh, the jail. Yeah, you yeah, gotta I, get in there. It's really cool. Right? Yeah, it's cool when it's me getting in the jail. Sheriff, don't look too friendly. Hey, we still haven't seen the Santa house. No, but we gotta go to the jail first. Yeah, she wants me to go to jail before we see Santa. I get it. Everybody's in line taking their turn to go to jail. Only in America. How you doing, sir? Get on in there. You don't want to, you gonna go in there with him, lady? No, sir. All right, you can stick that stick way out and take a picture. I'm in the uh, hoose gallery. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, no, my bell. He's in the jailhouse. He's nah. sitting there, look. He's in the jailhouse now. Who's down? I told him it? once or twice. <laughs> oh my goodness. Quit <laughs> playing cards and shooting dice. Oh, man. He's in the jailhouse now. I'll change my way. Luckily, I was able to make my escape when I figured out there was no lock on the door. I think we're going to the Santa house. It's the talking. No! <laughs> it scared me. Santa house. I've seen him. Santa. It's really his house. I don't get all crazy asking Santa for stuff. Oh, you think I can sit on his lap? <laughs> no, he's Santa. I know, but I think I'm bigger than he is. But, uh, well, no, quit it. And here we are. Santa's house. Look. There he is. I told you. He, I told you Santa was in here. I know. He's been trying to get. He's been trying to get me in here all day. She's been procrastinating. Procrastinating. No, I would break the chair. No, no. What if I just kind of just hug her? You, you said you're gonna sit on Santa's lap. There you go. Now, you ask him for all that expensive stuff now. <laughs> you know, I don't know of anything right now. <laughs> oh, she's got, <laughs> she's got the greatest jewel of all, I guess. I know, I've got my husband. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I do say you love. There's a shot for you. I'd like to thank my wife for taking me to Santa's yeah. home. You didn't sit on his lap. But you did, and that will be a meme for years to come, just so you know. Hey, I haven't <laughs> sat on Santa's lap since I was very little. It's a wee little girl, I know. Wee little. This is the livery stable. Where you stable your livery. 
whatever the whatever the, that is. I don't know. What's with all these strange people coming in here? The, the bow and the buggy. That is a cool buggy. It's going to be the 1800s. You know it's real. No fakes here. There's a snowman. Wish you a merry Christmas and a happy. Singing from the Half Pint Saloon. They've got cool projections too, where they're doing carols. This is neat. It's kind of like you actually have some carolers right in front of you, but they're on video. Half bath, half front. Look, they got a lot of junk you can put on. Why do I keep talking with a southern accent? I have no idea. There's, there's a tub. 1800s tub. Let's say half bath, half price. <laughs> Santa's getting all clean and she gushed up for Christmas. Of course, that would keep you warm in the wintertime. And I guess the mirror there would show you how you look when you were done. And that's whatever. What is that? That is cool. It's a cigar store. It's a cigar store. It's all psychedelic looking too. My little reindeer friend. We should be right home here. Seriously, this is kind of trippy. Uh, nutcrackers, and snowman, and the lights. It's like 19, 1870s. <laughs> Horses everywhere. Okay, really just one tonight, but you know, it's a horse. Don't look now, but I think we've got a blacksmith actually sniffing. Wow. What is it you're making? Excuse me? What is it you're making? I am making a horseshoe heart. Horseshoe. Cool. Can't wait to see how that works out. Do something like that. That is cool. You don't sell those, do you? Yes, I do. How much is that? Twenty dollars. Twenty? I had to ask, didn't I? Yeah. You got, you got I, the money. I was busy paying. What did you get? He just made it about 45 minutes ago. Oh, yeah. Hot off the press. It really Literally. is. It's cold. <laughs> it's cold but. now, but it was hot off the press. You know, you've bought enough tonight. My pockets are full. Yeah, my pockets are full. <laughs> no, I'm, your pockets are I'm, empty. I'm, I'm, no, I'm carrying your, you know, my money pockets yeah. empty. Yeah, you got a I've reindeer. Got your you got reindeer. a reindeer in one pocket. Yeah, I'm pretty much weighed down. Wait, I got the horseshoe. See? Oh yeah, I got the reindeer. Yeah, and I've got the this, candy. This thing is heavy, so if I have a full muscle tomorrow, we'll know what. Thanks for joining us on our tour of Dogwood Pass in Beaver, Ohio. Yes, yeah, some old-time Western stuff happened tonight. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed that. If you did, give it a big thumbs up and consider subscribing to our channel. We'd really appreciate it. We really would, and we hope you come visit. And thank you, by the way, for. Those of you who helped us get to a thousand plus subscribers, ah, wonderful. What? Gonna try to keep bringing quality content to you. Hopefully that's what you'll do and you'll check out some of our other videos too. You've got your favorites, but we hope you'll look at some of our others. Pull up a playlist and just binge. We'll see you later at the next video. Bye. First impression. Dogwood Pass. The horse is coming back. I keep getting in the horse. I know. Thing. You can't. We're in the middle of town. That's where the horses go. Not coming by now. All right. First impression. Go. We didn't take it personally. All right. First impression. Go. Amazing. This place, we've been here an hour and a half. We've only been in probably a fifth of the buildings. They are so original. Most of it is original. But the incredible, uh-oh, we're in the, the way, the way of the, the horse, horse again. again. <sighs> okay, so there's a mine too. And look at, yeah, look. Look how the water trails down from trying to find your, your, your booty. <laughs>
Yeah, you know, the, the, the gold ore stuff. Cheese. <laughs> did you get my good sign? <laughs> I did. Awesome. <laughs> you bad scared the bejeebas out of me, actually. <laughs> the first one. <laughs> I thought it was a guy behind me talking, actually. <laughs> are you are you Frosty? I'm Frosty the magical snowman. Ooh. You're awesome. Hey, special trip today. We're in the middle of the town and I think they're gonna hang the snowman. Oh, oh, save Frosty! <laughs> no!